I know, right? Where the hell have I been? It's been about two years since I uploaded a video, a full video. I've uploaded a few shorts since then, but folks, you ready for two years of footage? Let's go. Take a look at them. Okay. okay. Did you want that lava lamp? Oh, uh, did you bring it? I don't have any more cash on me other than the 80. For real? Yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, check them out. Again. That's cool. I clean out storage units and Do you? people try to throw away stuff. I'm like, oh yeah. Keep Man, I, I like when they still have the posters on, on the inside, like that one. Mm -hmm. That's cool. I, I know they got to be worth something. Somebody might like them. You find uh, video game stuff often? She kept a lot of that stuff. That yeah. Awesome, but I'm sure I can find it. I had this dude who sold to me before. Mm -hmm. He hit me up with some really nice Super Nintendo games. Some that I've been looking for. Yeah. And I was like, you looking to sell to me again? I was getting all excited. <laughs> he was like, no, I don't have a Super Nintendo. And he's like, and I know one of these is worth some money. He's like, I was hoping I could come by your house and you could test them out for me, make yeah. sure they work. I was like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, you sure you don't want to sell to me? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I ain't going to give you. Do you know people who buy like, uh, like toys? Like the toys I sent you? That the figurines or the home star? I don't um, know if it was like $125 for one of them. All of these still have the posters in them. Yeah. This is definitely somebody's collection. Oh yeah. yeah! Oh my gosh, that's, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's something you don't see when it still has stuff attached. Uh, yeah, you could probably flip that easy. Well, I keep Nintendo powers. <laughs> I've got so many Nintendo Power uh, posters all over, all over the wall in there. This is a nice one. Ocarina of Time. Does it still have the poster? Everything still in there? Uh, feels like it, yep. Hey! Superman. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Children of Man. I think I've got that poster. Maybe I already have that, that issue. I don't know anything about it. Oh, that was cool. Sonic. Yep, still in there. These are all N64 and GameCube and Wii era. Something to read while I'm on the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Your car down, man? Yeah. 
having some issues with it. The lava lamp. I had one of these when I was a kid. Me too. And we moved. We used to live across town, and we moved. Um, I lost it in the move somehow. I don't know what happened to it. Uh, heck yeah. All right, we say 80 bucks. Yep. All right, count Thank that, make sure it's all there. All right, man. Hi, uh, I messaged you about the Pokemon game this morning. Yeah. Did you happen to bring it? Um, it, it actually was cleaning the truck out. Will you see if you can find that Pokemon game? I don't know if it's in the truck or not. All right. So, it should be where I've had it last. How much are you asking on your games over here? Um, the PlayStation games, about three apiece. Okay. And the Xbox games? Um, about the same. Okay. Um, ten. No Pokemon? Oh man. Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, it's got to be at the house. I don't know. I had it in my hand yesterday and then um, it was in the truck, so I don't know where it's going to be. Can I get with you later today? Yeah. yeah okay. Once I go home, it's your hand. Um, All right. And as soon as I locate it, I'll hit you up. Okay. All right, I got four off of you. Okay. Okay.
I'm just gonna take that Nintendo. Yeah. Is that 10? Yeah. No, alright. Hopefully it still works. I can get it to work. We want to risk it for 10. Yeah, that's the reason I said it got wet and I don't know, I haven't tried it out. That's why I was yeah. like, otherwise I'll be much more. <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah. All right, so I just picked this whole bundle up here uh, from an old friend who reached out to me and said, Hey, uh, my son's video games are just sitting around collecting dust, and uh, if you want them, you can have everything for 60 bucks. So I Venmoed her $60, and we've got a bunch of Xbox 360 and some GameCube stuff in here, and I will go through more of that later, but I am outside getting eat up by gnats, and so it's time to take this in and go through all of it with you guys. Let's do it. All right, so I figured we'd just go through this bag of everything that I got from her for 60 bucks. We got two consoles and a bunch of games, so... For the 360, we got Wipeout in the Zone, Medal of Honor, Warfighter Limited Edition, Connect Adventures. Of course, you can't have a 360 bundle without Connect Adventures. Got Lego Jurassic World, Madden 17. That's the last Madden for the 360. Oh, that's a nice little bug right there. Uh, so that I think that still sells anywhere between 15 to 20 bucks just for that game alone. <clears throat> Let's see, we've got uh, Lego Marvel Super Heroes, Just Dance 3, Minecraft. Now, I know Minecraft should sell anywhere at like around 20 bucks. That is a little bit scratched. That's going to need to be resurfaced. <clears throat> Motion Sports, Dance Central 3, Halo Reach. Got Madden 15, Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare, Halo 3, Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag, DreamWorks Superstar Carts. That's about a 15 to 20 dollar game as well. Uh, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon. I think that's it for the 360 games. Well, here's another one: Assassin's Creed 3. Then we get into the GameCube games, and there's a good bit, and there's some, there's a couple of solid titles in here, but we got Need for Speed Underground, and most of these are complete. Um, Army Men, Real Real Time Strategy. Let's see, I don't even know what this is. Uh, ATV Two with the manual, no cover art. Madden 2004, that's in there. Here's a pretty solid one, Battalion Wars, and that's complete. Then, let's see, a few more in here. Got Medal of Honor, European Assault, Army Men, Sarge's War, Lego Star Wars 2 Original Trilogy. Here's a, this used to be real solid until they put this game out on the Switch, but we've got Battle for Bikini Bottom. Uh, should still sell pretty quickly, but that's complete. What else do we have in here? Got a couple more games. 
Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 2, and the big one, and this is going to be, this is going to need to be put in, oh man, please don't tell me that that whole entire cover art is jacked up, because I did not notice that, but, oh no, okay, it's not, it's not ribbed up, I just need to uh, reinsert it. And straighten that out but that's complete and that's the big one this should sell because it's complete anywhere between 70 to 80 bucks there's all my money back we've got black gamecube and it has ncaa football 2004 in it why couldn't it be a mario game we got a couple of xbox 360 controllers we got modern warfare 3 and just a white one and then we've got the black controller for the GameCube and then stay tuned and I'll have this 360 pulled out and then we have the 360 with no hard drive it is a 4 gig but we should definitely be able to get our $60 back plus some good profit um, selling hit and run alone should make all the money back, everything else is profit. Not a bad deal for 60 bucks. Not a bad deal at all. All right, folks, on to the next. All right, folks, so it's about 8.30 and I just saw on Facebook Marketplace, there's a yard sale with a bunch of video games. $5 each or three for 10. Um, I saw mostly disc-based games, but I did see some N64 games laying on top. And we're about eight or nine minutes away. Hopefully, majority of it's still there. Uh, but we're we're gonna find out here here in just a few minutes. So stay tuned. Morning. Good morning. How are you doing today? Good. How are you? Pretty good. All right, so unfortunately, I went through all those boxes of games, and uh, there's just really nothing there. There's a bunch of commons, nothing, nothing more than like ten bucks, and they were asking five dollars each, uh, or three for ten, but nothing I needed, and nothing worth worth picking up to me. So on to the next. Okay, I'm just gonna grab those three from you. Okay. You said 20? Yeah. Oh. All right, there's 20. Right, I appreciate you. it. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
inside. Okay. All right, I appreciate it, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So the first game was Fear Files. I've never seen this, but this is a complete standalone expansion pack uh, series. This goes for about 30 bucks. It's gonna need a little cleaning up on the inside. The case, the case is busted. I can easily switch out the case. But the cover art's in good condition. The manual's in good condition. The disc is in fantastic condition. And the second one is Alice Madness Returns. I mean, that's a no-brainer. That's a $25 to $30 game as well. Uh, for six bucks and it is complete there we go right there disc looks to be in fantastic condition i was already here this pawn shop found these and he did not accept debit card so i had to go grab some cash from the atm and i came back and here we go all right all right so just leaving that yard sale up there and for 20 bucks got a Sega Game Gear missing a back but it comes with Sonic the Hedgehog 2 it comes with a super wide gear and a few other games we got Mortal Kombat we got Mortal Kombat 2 and let's see, we got NFL Quarterback Club 96, World Series of Baseball, and then we got Sonic Frontiers, that should be about 30 bucks right there, and Animal Crossing on the Switch, that should be about 40 bucks right there. So for 20 bucks all together, all in, I'm good with that, on to the next. So just leaving this pawn shop and spent $18, picked up three games. We got Street Fighter 4 Ultra for on the PS3. It's about a $25 game. Got Captain America Super Soldier. That's complete. That's about a $30 game, I want to say. And then NCAA Football 13 complete. That's another $25 game. So not bad for 18 bucks. We in one of the biggest game stops I've ever been in. This place is huge. I mean, it's massive. But here's a game that y'all need to be on the lookout for. And uh, if you don't believe me, go ahead and look up sold listings on eBay. It's going for a hundred dollars or more. And um, I found a copy in this game stop. And what you're going to be looking for is this one right here. Dead by Daylight, the Nightmare Edition, because it features and includes a Stranger Things chapter. They got it for 40 bucks all day. Be on the lookout for this game. I'm about to make at least 60 bucks off of it. All right, so after using a $25 off promo coupon, it came to $14.99 plus tax $16.04 from $40. Turn around and sell it for $100 all day. Don't sleep on your GameStop uh, pre-owned games. You gotta look sometimes, you might find a gem. It's going to keep getting hotter and hotter. Yeah, man. It's that time of year. <laughs> there you go. Two. Oh, Does that right. work for you? Yeah, man. All right. I appreciate so. it. I appreciate it, man. I'll run across some games sooner or later. Huh? Yeah, I yeah. dug in there for a while, and I didn't see anything. So just leaving this cell right here, it was an indoor cell, and picked up two Sony Handycams for five dollars each 
Uh, even if I can't get these working for parts only, I mean, they're selling for way more than $5, so I'm going to consider that a win. On to the hot dogs and coats for two dollars. Got a whole little box of Wii games. Nothing crazy. There's a Sonic Riders. That's probably the best game in there. But I want to see what they want for the whole box. If it's cheap enough. I'll grab all of it. Nothing crazy, crazy. Uh, got there's a couple of ten dollar games in here. There's that Sonic Riders. I picked up some horror DVDs. But she wanted a dollar each. Dollar no holla, I'm in. I'm in all day, but there was 20 all together. She only charged me 15. So there's money to be made. On to the next. Yes, it's already in here. Here. Whose name are All right, so in good will, I'm going to have to talk pretty loud because we got music playing right above me, but found two TI-84 Plus Silver Editions. Let's see what we got on those. $2.99 each. That's a, that's a pickup all day. All day. Nice. It's going to be easy flip. Okay, so definitely don't sleep on these. This entire set is selling easily for over $200 on eBay. Just picked up the entire set for $50. I could list it for, you know, $175 and that would sell quickly. So be on the lookout for those. Things that help you. Do you have any change? Uh, yes. I got two 20s. Change? A dollar piece. Oh, shoot. I'm sorry. Um, 15. I'm about to go get breakfast, but I'll run to the store before I go. Here, look in there. I gotta set these down. Let's see what we got. Hold it. Alright, I appreciate it, man. Alright, so back there at that sale, I picked up this little bundle for 25 We got a GBASP 001 model. It had Naruto Council, Naruto. Ninja Council. That's about a $14, $15 game. Probably sell that for easily $50, $60. Bucks. And then Cabela's Big Game Hunter and The Incredible Hulk. Haven't worked those up yet. And if this PS3 controller uh, charges and works, that's an easy 20 right there. On to the next. Back to the right and like, 
Said twenty, right? Yeah, twenty. All right. All right. Mind if I give him a look real quick? Just, just Google. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes there's a paved road back here behind us, which is actually closer to our house. Mm -hmm. And sometimes Google will take you back there. It um, and it did, but I turned around. I was like, look for double trash cans. That's right. I know. Um, I think it's Apple Maps will bring you right here. And then somebody mentioned one other time, uh, there's, is it a way? I think the ways. Ways, yeah. I think it works okay. I haven't used ways in a long time. I, the only time I've ever used if we're going on a long trip because it gives you the yeah, place where, to know where the police are sitting. Yeah, right. right. <laughs> That's why I use it. Let me know when the uh, speed traps are set up. That's exactly right. I'm just making sure everything's here. Yeah, man. Thank you, Tim. You don't have anything older, like like original Nintendo or Super Nintendo, anything like that? My brother's got some stuff. Um, I think that he's posted recently. I could reach out to him and see what he's got left. Yeah, I like uh, I like to collect, and I collect a lot of the older stuff, like cartridge yeah, games just, and whatnot. He just sold, I think, a Sega Genesis and um, some of those things. I, I can see what he's got left in the... And give you his number. Yeah, man, if you could hit hit him up. All right. Yeah. All right, so leaving the pawn shop, picked up a Retron 2 HD and a stack of games for 64.79. I'm not sure how much this goes for, but we got Final Fantasy, Mario Duck Hunt, Mario Arcade, Turtles 3 Manhattan Project, there's Metroid, uh, TNC Surf Design, Tiger Healy, Knight Rider, Terminator 2, there's Mario Paint, Super Mario World, Terminator 2, F-Zero, Paperboy, and WrestleMania the arcade game. Not a bad deal for 65 bucks. Not a bad deal at all. How much you got on your video games? Um, a dollar a piece. Dollar a piece. I'm down for that. Okay. We're looking to get rid of stuff. <laughs> Absolutely. Make you happy. Can I get you a box? No, ma'am. I think I'm going to be okay. Okay. Elf doll. That's pretty neat. Definitely gonna pick that up. 
the 1986 ALF over there at that sale for five bucks. All right, awesome, thank you. And I guess I need so to put this 14. down somewhere. So the nearby area. Yeah. So give me a bag. Alright, appreciate it. Thank you. Not anymore. All right, thank, thank you. you, sir. You have a good day. You too. Thank you. All right. That's a uh, fact. I thought it was a cheap girl, but it ain't that. <laughs> no, it's a uh, it's my daughter's. So I don't know a where she went. Printer thing like do. Uh, yeah, for. Yeah. Uh, for the so just leaving this pawn shop, and I found a sealed copy of Hogwarts Legacy on the Xbox Series X for six bucks. That should fetch me about 35, maybe 40 bucks. On to the next. So I'm at this little garage sale and uh, I just asked for video games. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so it's some, just the games, okay. Yeah, he actually has some chapsticks in there. Sure, but you're I'll welcome take a to look. all those. Ugh, I mean, you can just have them. Mm -hmm. Mater National, Mario Kart, yeah. Super Mario 3D Land, True Swing Golf, Backyard Baseball, Super Mario Bros. 2, and 13. What would you want on them? You can have them. Are you sure? Yeah. Take the case and all of them. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, you wouldn't happen to have anything else, though, would you? No. I, um, I didn't. And this is why you always ask. And she just went in for more. Stay tuned. <clears throat> to all this stuff to try to sell and get something <laughs> out of it to buy the new, um, the new one. And they're all empty? Yeah. Okay. So I'm in a state sale right now. There's this vintage Goosebumps pinball for 25. There's a vintage 94 Power Rangers tabletop pinball. And then we got some fur babies back here. This is probably gonna be the best bang for the buck. And these will sell very fast. Probably a lot quicker than these pinball machines. <clears throat> so I'm definitely gonna pick these up. Price is negotiable. We'll work on that ten dollars each. Mm -hmm. 
So I'm not sure if I got this on video when I picked these up at the yard sale. Um, I went to a few weeks ago and I actually went twice to this yard sale. I was one of the first people there early in the morning. It was about 45 minutes away. And the lady said that not everybody was there. Um, there were more people joining in on the yard sale. So I came back like an hour later and these golf clubs were sitting on the table for a dollar each. There's 23 of them. And uh, I gave her a $20 bill for all 23. They're all tailor-made. Ping, Callaway. Uh, they're all like top name brands. I've already sold two on eBay and made all of my money back that I invested on them. I'm getting ready to sell this one locally for $75. I've got it listed on eBay, but I also listed a few of them locally. And this one's going for around $75, so about to meet up with the guy. Let's make this money. That's a cool blanket. I got 20 on me. What can that get me? If you want all that wee stuff, I'll do 20 on it. All right. That sounds good. Yeah, I'll take it. All right. <clears throat> I, don't, I don't want it. And the one that I got, you know. <laughs> well, there, there were three systems there. So that's all of it, right? Yeah, so you can have all those right. systems too. All right, cool. See how much they want on that for sure. <coughs> There's nobody out here, they're having a sale, so we'll just keep looking around. Found, definitely found some video game stuff. Let's see if 
find mm -hmm. something else. Mm -hmm. Here's your 20 for that. Thank you so much. And just You're take welcome. You sure? Okay. Bye, kitty. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, y'all go. Is it Pinehurst? Alrighty. That's over 50 feet of rope all tied up into a bracelet. Oh, it can be undone oh, to help you lower yourself down oh. or whatever. Somebody has been a collector of Disney dolls. Mm -hmm. All Disney stuff in general. Hey, yeah. Sure. You just got the eight balls. Oh, yeah, perfect. That's exactly the kind of stuff I look for. No. No. I used to have a collection. What would you want on everything? The whole, whole box. <laughs> like these are Super Nintendo games, and this is an original Nintendo, so right. that won't. They don't work. They don't with play that. with that. They don't yeah. play with these that system. The right, but this is. Nintendo. I'd still be interested in everything. What do you think is fair? What do you know about this stuff? Yeah, what I do you collect. Think is fair? Uh, Thirty bucks. I was thinking forty. Forty. Yeah. I can do forty. Forty. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I All think right. that's probably worth more than that. But that's okay. Yeah. What am I doing? See. All right. Uh, let me go grab okay. my cash, okay. and I'll be right yeah, back. Oh yeah, let's dig through here and see what we can find. Hey, how are you? Well, next person that comes along looking at your games, give them that great deal. Uh -huh. I'm just going to take what I got off your All hands right. for 10 Thank you. I appreciate it. Have a good day. Thank you. Take your album here. It's $2. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all have a great day. So, I will be able to recap a few things that I picked up today. I won't be able to recap every little thing. A lot of it's already sold. Uh, Super Nintendo games. We've got the big one, Super Bonk. That's about an $80 game. 
Super Empire Strikes Back, Power Rangers, Zeo Battle Racers, Super Star Wars, Tournament Fighters, Super Mario Kart, Kirby's Avalanche, Air Strike Patrol, WCW Super Brawl Wrestling. These two surprisingly around $35 game, $30 game. Um, so that's be on the lookout for that one. Uh, let's see. And then we got Super Mario All-Stars. That's already sold. Um, Jungle Book, Bubsy, NBA Jam Tournament Edition, Lethal Weapon, Mario Paint, Super Caesar's Palace. Uh, let's see. And then we got The Suffering, Ties That Bind. Um, always a game that sells well. Um, so when I saw that it was only Case of Manual, I picked it up. Um, that's going to be something that <clears throat> someone's going to be looking for. Then we got Wii Sports, Mario Kart. There's some, you know, shovelware right here. Um, Dangerous Hunts, Lego Batman, Star Wars, Need for Speed, Captain America, Hulk. Uh, we got one of these thrown in there. That's about 15 bucks. Already plugged it in. Works great. Um, and another game was Family Feud that belongs in there. All right. Here's a hat that you didn't see. Um, pick this up for five dollars brand new with tags sells for 30 plus shipping it's vintage coogie nice little hat picked up these ugly ass shoes from goodwill uh, for less than seven dollars and they go anywhere between 80 to 100 dollars dep depending on color and they are sia somewhere in america the the name brand is sia and i think these are called um foam something something see ya foam something i don't know they're ugly but they sell well and shoot money all day i did pick up those fur babies these are the smaller versions of the furbies um this one goes for about 40 bucks 35 40 bucks that one goes for around uh 25 and this one also goes for around 35 40 and i was able to get them uh for five dollars each so the guy gave me half price. They were listed at 10. Okay, this is a cool piece. This is 1982 Nintendo official Donkey Kong gumball machine coin, game, uh, coin bank. Now, this appears to be brand new sealed. It doesn't appear that it's ever been opened except for a little tear in the seal right there. It, here's what's bugging me. The only other one that I could find that looked exactly like this had some sort of Donkey Kong um, piece of paper right here on the front of the gumball machine. And it also had some sort of paper something or another, a coin, in the coin slot. But this doesn't appear like it's ever been opened. I mean, it's still factory sealed. So I don't know what's going on with that, but it's really cool. Official Donkey Kong, I'm in. So in that tote that I paid $40 for, there was a very clean Nintendo. It had Super Mario Brothers 3 in there. Um, the box, the challenge set box, the manual and all the inserts were inside the box. Uh, I am keeping that. That's going to be the one thing that I'm keeping out of everything that I bought today. Uh, so that's going in the collection, but this was very nice, very clean. Then we also have... I picked up four Wiis. Um, one has already sold on eBay, just the console alone. This is a full bundle with two controllers, two nunchucks, all the cords and everything. I've got this sold on Marketplace. Guys coming by tomorrow to pick it up. And then that leaves me with one more Wii to sell here. I've got to get this one cleaned. Um, I've already tested it. It plays great, but it just needs a good cleaning. And then this one is straight up for parts. It will not take in disc, will not read, so that one's listed. I figured I would go ahead and show the challenge set Super Mario 3. It's complete in there and pretty nice condition box. Really nice condition box. It's got a little ding here and there, but nice condition for me. I didn't have it complete. I do now. All right, folks, I know it's been two years, but I'm glad I was able to share some footage with you. I'm always recording. 
and I'm always game hunting, so I might as well continue to share more videos. So be on the lookout, and folks, on to the next. Thank you.